Greetings and welcome back to the Dungeons of Dreadmore, where Shifty is currently making his way through the second level of the dungeon. We are about to return to him now to find out whether he chooses the red pill or the blue pill. Okay, I can smash that one. Okay, we're gonna go on the blue one. Hyperborean Empowerment. Alright. That one's been drained. I can smash those. I've never noticed that I could smash those types of things before. Alright, what does this chalk say? Chalk scroll. It says, Beware the diggles. They're not your friends in nature. Alright. Well, I've already kind of worked that one out. Right, we are slowly getting the rest of this map map. Uh, this level max. Oh, hello, Max. Fancy meeting you here. Once again, I need to move this over there. Oh, there's the adventuring pants if I wanted to make something. My lord, tome of too much information. Swashbuckling belt. Supple leather, leather gloves. A historically inaccurate Viking helm. <laughs> well played. Iron ring, copper ring. Hmm. I'm not sure there's anything really here that I want, except for possibly that uh, those pants. Let me check. Was there something I could make with those? I think there was. Yes. I could make lederhosen. Which I know better than what I've got. Never mind. Okay, well, there's nothing here, so I'm just going to uh, sell a bunch of stuff. Oh, actually, I'm not. Because I've only just come back here, so I haven't really got much stuff to sell. Uh, let's pop back to my wizarding dimension then and pick up the uh, sale loot whilst we've got the chance. Right. And here we go. Actually, not nearly as much stuff as I was expecting to have to sell. Alright. Moving on, then. Thank you for that, Brax. I do sometimes like visiting your shop. Right. Only... Well, there's two paths down and one path to the west down there. Oh, where am I going? Where did I just end up? Not where I wanted to be. Take me back. I've been here before. I didn't properly clean up after myself, my lord. What? I haven't done anything yet. Take that. Okay. What about you? Ha <laughs> ha! No. I'll fight you. Gads. Right. Let's uh, try and take you out as fast as we can. Down here and pow! an awful lot of uh, damage to that. He collapsed in a pile of fluid and pain filled with love. Oh, that feels horrible. Okay, now what's going to be in this chest, I wonder? Another belt! My lord, there's belts everywhere all of a sudden. Mass pitting mechanism above. Aha! This is going to have some sort of... Uh, suddenly monsters will drop down from above, so we're not going to worry about that for just a second. I didn't find any stakes in there. But I can cook the ones that I've got. And that is pretty good. Five grilled steaks. I approve. Most heartily. Thank you. And I'm really sorry about this. I'm not really. I wouldn't have done it if I felt that bad. Uh, though that is a little bit not what I want. How about you guys just file in a nice orderly queue. And I will deal with you one at a time. Damn it, I need better armor. We're not going to be able to handle the lower levels with this current armor that we've got. As much as I like the coat of tweed, I think we need something far, far more beefy. Uh, let's deal with you for that. Okay, crack dog. Oh, we can make that into a lot of things, actually. Adventuring gloves. Wow, this actually leads to quite a lot of stuff. What? Did that just not go right or something? We can take care of you guys behind the grates there. I cannot, however, take care of you so easily, I don't think. Right, let's just wait for these guys to either come to me or die. There we go, that's one. Two, and you should be easily killed as well. Hello. Sorry about this. 
Oh, he bowed. Hate it when they do that. Makes me feel horrible. Aha! It actually works. And some more bolts, which is actually quite a good thing to get. Now I can use my confiscate evidence on this one. Is there anything else in there? I don't think so. But I'm going to need to use that to get through that door. And further up as well to get the gold that the enemies dropped. Uh, in fact, I'll just go do that now, since it's just come back up. There we go. I wonder if people were just getting confused with the rocket punch. Because the time I tried it, it didn't work. But uh, quite a few people said that I just used it wrong. So that's probably what happened. But this one seems to just be working straight out of the box, more or less. Hello. Are you going to buy from me as well? Yes, you are. You are sometimes polite. Now, what are we going to find up here? I'm guessing an exit. No? I was expecting a stairs uh, down to the next level, actually. Oh, yes. Haha! -ha! My instincts are correct. Felt like I hadn't seen one in a while. Inky Hog Lantern. No. Right. We are almost done with this level, I feel. Which is just as well, because I've spent two hours recording it. If I was Plump Helmet Punk, I would upload all of this in one enormous file. I'm sorely tempted to, actually. But... That would... While it would be much easier for me if I had a team, I imagine there are quite a few people who wouldn't uh, have time to watch it all in one sitting. And I know that I get a little bit annoyed with uh, having to pause and... Uh, stop! Run away! Pause videos and return to them later. I'm going to need to wait for that ability to uh, recharge so I can go kill him. Okay, let's get rid of you then. It would feel bad leaving you here without any friends. Though I know, of course, that they will simply respawn. So maybe I should have just left you there. You clearly wanted to live. Uh, I'm a monster sometimes. I'm not actually going to worry about trying to get in here and get all that. What I will do, though, is go down here. Now, there are two chests that I haven't opened. And I'm wondering if they are ready for me to open or not. Did that just push him back and not actually hurt him? Well, damn. That's not very good. Oh, hello. I really should stop just walking so far in one go. It is going to get me killed sooner or later. Another one sparkling glove. Can I... Join them together and have two sparkling gloves, that would be kind of awesome. Hello. Are you going to attack me? Yikes, that almost hit me, actually. You take that. And I should no, not be able to deal with you. Uh, not liking this one, I appear to be in a bit of a sticky situation. Right, and you as well. Okay, not too bad. And some more chalk! Fantastic! The secrets of steel are mine! And, right, okay, so we're just gonna go down here and hopefully find out what's left of this place. Oh, you're asleep. I will wake you with riding plant roots of some variety. Scaffers roots. We'll continue exploring down, though, since this is. Wow, one very oddly shaped and very open room. What's over here? Ah, some boots. And some lederhosen. Just as well I didn't try to make any. Alright, not too bad so far. Uh, I didn't mean to move, I actually wanted to club you. And another secret recipe. Pop that straight in there. Come on, down we go. Right, what have we got? Timberbane, the all-natural blade. Um, we've actually got those. I'm not sure we've got them anymore. Damn it! We did have them. As I play this game more and more and, and find these different secret recipes, I start to hoard items that don't necessarily seem to have a value. In hoarding, that is. And that is usually why. 
because at some point I was playing, I sold something, and then immediately after selling it, I was suddenly in need of it. Rather frustrating. Please be dead. My goodness. You too, please. Stairs down? No. A trap. Oh, a chest. One armed leather. What is it with all these one handed, one armed things? Uh, hmm. That has a much better block chance. And a much. Uh, it's, well, double the armor absorption and double the block chance, actually. It's just it loses the flat mana. And. The health regen. But I gain cap. Uh, I'm gonna go for it. I need slightly better gear at the moment. Ah, oh, damn it! Well, you can just go into the loot fist gear then. Right, let's head back and drop off some sale junk. Okay, we don't want this. I, I'm, I'm going to be sorry to see you go, but it is time, I feel. Um, actually, I'm going to keep this this uh, one sparkling clef. I wouldn't be surprised at all if there is a way to get to craft them into two. So I'll keep hold of it for that. A cracked orb I'm going to keep as well because I may be able to uh, make that into something, into one of the other orbs, and I need a nature orb at the moment. Uh, we'll drop these. The chalk we're gonna, obviously going to keep, as well as these ingots. We'll drop the rest. The traps we'll sell, and that looks about right. What is this? Potion of purity. Small yellow potion fizzes quietly to itself with promises of a clean slate. Oh, that's lovely. Steam rocket bolt. Fantastic. I've got seven of them. Delivers an explosive charge via steam propellant. For maximum effect, aim at the enemy's feet. Warning, do not use the steam rocket bolt as a bludgeoning device. Wise words. Oh, hello. Were you here when I left? No, you are dead. It was a lie. Okay, what are we going to find in here? Another digger. This one is actually alive. Or was. And more tickle eggs. Have I got enough? Yes, I've got enough to make an omelette. Ah, glorious omelettes. Where are you, Ingot Press? Is it the Ingot Press I use for the omelettes? Have skill, have ingredients. Yes, it is. Oh! Hmm. I can make both of these. Okay. I agree. Fantastic work. Okay. Now there's food and drink there. And an unfriendly AI that I'm going to blast with this. Hopefully I'll be able to kill him. Yes. And for our troubles, we have an aluminium tube. Uh-oh. Something just got hit by a trap close by. What are we going to find in here? Not a whole lot. More eggs, though. If we can get another three, we can make another omelette. Odds of getting three of these eggs in one of these rooms, very slim. And indeed, this time it didn't work. Uh, let's go this way. We're actually really close now to finishing this level. Oh, it's going to be grand. Oh, dear. <sighs> Dare I. Dare I. Well, I'm going to be crafting that to something else, so there's no point. But, uh, dare I? Yes, I dare. Go on, then. Yay, he'd be pleased by us. Oh, oh, we've actually got a massive increase to our side radius. He felt bad about what he did last time. Bless you. Ah, oh, great. So now we've got enhanced visual sight radius and also haywire chance. Oh, hello, Diggle. And now our sight goes all the way over there. That's actually pretty good. It's going to be much harder for things to sneak up on us now. Which is just as well because this character probably couldn't take it if they did. Uh, okay, we're going to walk up past this chest and go for this door over there. That means going over this way. Yes, I haven't forgotten about you. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I want to kill the blobby. From afar. Kapow! Ah, oh, that's true. Doesn't even know I'm here. Probably can't even see me yet. I wonder if he can't, actually. That would be... Well, fairly cheeky, honestly. If that were the case, but uh, on the plus side, 
would actually make this significantly easier for me. Okay, I'm gonna actually have to get up there to attack you, aren't I? Alright. Now, there must be a shrine of inconsequence here around here somewhere. I refuse to believe there isn't. And that chest hasn't yet opened, no. Oh, but this one has, down here. Let's go to that one. Ooh. Can I get in there yet? Oh, I can. Fantastic. And down this way. What wonders lie in this chest, I wonder? Is crap, the ch charlatan remittance. Remittance, sorry. The patented Mr. Cranky TM crossbow reloading crank system means that even the most l languorous aristocrat can reload this heavy steel crossbow with ease. It is studded with black iron. And actually, I hate to say it, but it seems to be a fairly good crossbow. This one will be better when we've upgraded it, but for now... Well... Actually, it ends up one less damage, but it spreads the damage out a little bit and gives us a new resistance, so yeah, we'll take it. I'll just put that somewhere safe so I don't sell it later on. Alright, let's head back up and go down from up there. There we go. I'm going to take a sip of tea. Which has gone completely cold because it's been two hours since I last took a sip from that cup of tea. <sighs> this is terrible. Though. Okay. What have we got? Nothing much in this room except that trap, which I can sell. And obviously the ooze, which I'm picking up with increasing frequency, it seems. I wonder if I can sell that. I'm not sure, but uh, it may be worth finding out. Hello? Yes, hello. Let's uh, fall back a little bit to all get into a nice orderly line once again, and kapow! Ah, glorious. What, you again? I've never met you before. If I had, you would be dead, as you are now. Alright, what are we looking for down here then? Got a uh, pear wine. Okay. I'm sure that would actually taste quite nice. Not generally too much of a, a fan of pear alcohol, but uh, pear wine sounds like it would be quite delightful. Come here. Stop with the running away. Face your death like a man bat. A bat man, you could say. Right, what's that? Arcane. Turn it. What? It's a shield. Is it much better than this one? Ooh, well, hmm. It might be. It has no negatives. Whereas this one has two. Oh, no, sorry. It has one. What, minus one to my nimbleness. But, seems better in most of the, Except this one possibly gives me extra damage. No, it doesn't. Sorry. It gives me sneakiness. But four counterattack chance. One ab armor absorption and two block chance. This one just gives me three block chance, one armor absorption. Also gives me magic resistance, though. Mm. And magic rebound chance. And a little bit of extra mana. It's a difficult choice, that one, honestly. I this is enough to kill you. Yes, it is. It's getting remarkably powerful. Right, well, I'll take this. I actually think this might work out better for me in the long run. It's the counter chance that's nice on this. I'd lose one block chance. Yeah, the magic resist is nice, but I actually think we'll, we'll do better with that. So we'll go with that one. Oh man, we've got a long bloody walk now, don't we? Let's see if I can path my whole way there. Yes, I can. Ha ha! Lazy boat engaged. I will drink more tea. Even cold, it's still tea, and thus infinitely better than coffee. Alright. This is the last place. Please don't be too many things. Oh, I didn't mean to close the door. I apologize. I'm doing a rather large amount of damage. 
So many diggle eggs and another cranky crossbow. Uh, let's get rid of you. And I would like it if you just stay there for a moment while I compose myself. Give myself the power of magic steel. And then take you out. Like that! My goodness, that was good. That was completely worth doing. Right, let's grab all of these eggs. This is like a whole generation we're about to eat. Right, crafting omelets. Can I make another one? I could. My goodness. I've now got three deep omelets. That's fantastic. They give me 64 turns of health regen. Hello, Caltrops. Uh, there'll be a trap on here somewhere. There we go. And flippy floppies. And another trap. And another trap. So many traps. So much EXP. I don't know what order I've put these in previously, so I'm just going to plant them down and hope for the best. Please give me something awesome. That is actually what I was thinking about when I was thinking something awesome. That's fantastic. So we've now got two of these on the level. So I could come back here. The Reardon Metal Ingot. Free of government interference, this is the ent entrepreneurial wonder metal. Caution. Unregulated Reardon Metal Ingots. Free of government interference. May explode when exposed to oxygen and or sunlight. <laughs> okay. Amethyst. Platinum. Uh, Argent. Tight. I'm not sure what on earth that is. But uh, that's actually not bad at all. Make your own crafty crafts. Right. We have finished the level. Oh, happy days. Now, as I said, I am going to go around the level and possibly pick up some of the uh actually no i i don't think i will i'm i have no intention of using any of these portals this run i've done so in previous runs and it has always ended in the death of the character so no i'm gonna take the the, the sensible road and say no it ends here i'm not gonna propagate this this nonsense any longer i'm just gonna sell some of this rubbish uh you can go in there 90 Zorkwins, 129 Zorkwins. Yeah, I'll sell those. I know some people have said that uh, I should keep hold of those because they they can have pretty good uh, effects, and I know they do, but uh, I'd rather not have to juggle around. And The more things I've got in my inventory, the less I tend to use them because I never know what to use at any one time. So, uh, yeah, we're going to leave those behind. But I am going to drop off some of this alcohol. Actually... Let's pick some of it up, because I may be able to craft something from them all. Let's see. What can we craft? Go to my... Still, I can't do much. What about you? Oh, I can. My goodness, I can use the alchemical ooze to make things? Like this? Dear Lord. How fantastic. Acourageous. Yeah, we'll make that. I will... Go away and see if that can be made into anything else. No. Alas. Alas, it cannot. But I will go ahead and craft you as much as I can. Can I still go? What? Oh, I've still got one. So it's saying I can make more. Oh, well. No, that's good enough. Right. Let's uh, pop this ash flask over there. We're going to drop the majority of our... Well... Can I make any more of those bolts? No, it appears not. Let me just check out what I need for those particular bolts that I was making. These ones. Iron ingots, okay. I'm sure I can pick those up. So we'll drop this. Up the VK. Potion of Radiance. Oh, the vitriol. Right, we'll get rid of all of you, just drop all of those down. And those, but that's pretty good to know that I can just use that to make that kind of thing. Uh, the fortress as well. Uh, I'm pretty happy with what we've got there then. We'll move the barbed copper bolts over here. Keep those on the menu there. Now the aluminium tube can go down. This is obviously going to be kept. Drop you. We've also got a bunch of tinkering components that I can drop. Okay, that's looking a bit better. 
Now then, what I would like very much is to be able to make some ingots. Okay, let's see what we can make. Ingot press, I can make tin, zinc, gold, silver, platinum. There we are. Is there any more of those? Yes, I have. Fantastic. I want to make some aluminium, but I'm not really sure that I need to. Can make some brass ingots. Again, not really sure that I would need to. Now I can make some steel. I'm going to need some of that, so I'm going to make some steel. That's it. Oh, dear lord, I can make... Oh, right, I can turn those into uh, ingots. Can I? That's pretty cool. Aquavitae, and I can make Riordan metal ingots. Wow. That's pretty interesting. But no, I'm going to drop that, and I'm going to drop the rest of these as well. I'm going to leave that there. In fact, I'm going to just drop the chalk in that there. All the rest of these can go down there. Okay, now we're cooking with fire. Drop those there. Oh, right then. Now, let's see. Have ingredients. That's what we want. So that gets rid of all of those, and I just need a little bit more of these then. I'll get rid of two of these. Alright, that is not bad at all. So I've got poison ampule bolts and acid ampules. And acid ampule bolts. Hmm. That's weird, they've got different looks. Mine appear to be significantly better. Alright. Well then, let's go ahead and drop the acid ampule though. Uh, sorry, the acid flask, because I'm not really going to use it for anything else. And, right, I think we are more or less ready to go on to the next area. Did I just do that? I did just do that. Ah, damn it. I got absorbed in my crafting and I forgot to pick up all the things I wanted to sell. I'm going to have to walk around until my... Wizarding keys. Let's be back into my wizarding portal. Damn you, wizarding keys. Okay. Pick up the everything. I'm going to be sorry to see you go, Coat of Tweed. But it is time. Okay. And the lederhosen. Uh, I'll, actually, I'll keep the adventuring gloves. I might be able to use them to craft something later. Okay. On to level three. Well done, Shifty. You're doing fantastically well so far, I must confess. I, I'm honestly quite proud of how far you've gotten. <sighs> but I don't know how much further you're going to get. But that is the end of this episode. Ooh, look, it's all robotic. Look, Ah, another mystical graffiti. You're haunting me now that you know I don't want you. But uh, that is the end of the episode. I hope you've enjoyed, and I hope you'll be joining us in the next. But until then, do take care.